how is my purple group today? I want you to turn in your book to the page that says 11. I'm trying to get mine focused here. And you'll see a little sign over here that says no bullying. So this story must be about a bully. I want you to read the story to yourself and then we'll read it together after you've done it to yourself. Okay, Carly used to like school. She loved getting up in the morning and looked forward to spending the day learning and playing. I hope that's how all of you feel about coming to Walnut Grove. However, this year was different. This year, a girl named Ivy was in her class. Ivy was always mean to Carly. She would call her names at recess and make fun of her clothes. Ivy would make mean faces at Carly and spread rumors about her. Do you know what rumors are? Rumors are when you say something um, about someone to somebody else and they're probably not true. And they're, they're very mean. Carly pretended like she was sick every morning and would tell her parents that she shouldn't go to school. Carly would cry herself to sleep every night. Her mom finally sat Carly down and asked her what had been bothering her. She eventually decided to tell her mom about Ivy. Carly's mom called the teacher and let her know what was going on. The teacher talked with Ivy and her parents and things started improving at school. Carly was happy that she let everyone know that she was being bullied. Now, boys and girls, I hope that you know that if you ever feel like um, Carly in this story, then you need to talk to your parents and Mrs. Dodson and tell them that you are feeling that way so we can help you. So this says the problem. So what was the problem in this passage? And then the solution. How did the problem get better? You're going to write the problem here, the solution here. Let's predict. A prediction is when you make a guess about what will happen. <coughs> Excuse me. Do you think Carly will start enjoying school again? Why or why not? Now I'd like for you to draw a picture and write a sentence that shows the beginning, the middle, and the end. The vocabulary focus. Draw a line to match the words that mean about the same thing. Rumors, pretended, bothering, improving, cry. Troubling, sob, invented, gossip, getting better. So you're going to draw a line from the word here, rumors, to what you think is about the same word. And then the last one, you're going to, what message is the author trying to teach in this story? So think about what this happened in the story and the problem and the solution. And how, why do you think the author might be writing this story? Great job today, boys and girls.